Okay, so I'm gonna go into a bit more detail how I set it up, configuring the 7100 for the ISS in the VFO. So all I did was, you know, let's say, put the receive frequency in, first of all. We're in VFO mode, by the way. So frequency input, type in 437, you know, 800, something like that. Dep you know, depends where you want to start. If it's coming towards you, you might be better off on 810. So 437, 810. And you want to enable a tone of 67, so long press tone. Move the, the large tuning knob to change the tone there to 67. And make sure you're just in repeater tone setting uh, here. Repeater tone. And then add, add a split to it, press menu. Press it again. So it's on memory panel number one and then press split, activate the split. You press A, B to swap them round. And now in the top line, you can type in 145990. You'll be keeping that there because that's the frequency you transmit on. So it's all about entering the frequencies with that frequency input. Press A, B, swap them round and you're done. I mean, if you wanna have it in super super smooth tuning mode long press the kilohertz and select one kilohertz step and now you'll be transmitting on the bottom line receiving on the top you've got a tone set make make sure you've got your tone set because i've just created it but it's not visible there now it says tone at the top so we're ready to go. And if you've got it set on one kilohertz, you can do this beautiful smooth tuning as it's coming towards you in the VFO. You know, and that really is the end of the video. But on a final note, if you wanted to be clever, you could save these out to channels. I've already done it, you know. You know, you'd line up a channel on a bank, you know, using, get it in memory mode. You'd line up a channel on a bank, you know, find an empty channel, a series, you know, perhaps five or six empty channels, then go to VFO, press menu until you've got MW, memory right. And then you can save the receive and the transmit with the split and all the parameters in place uh, to open the repeater. So long press, long press MW. Is it long press or one press? I think I've done it. If I press to manual mode now, that channel's gone in with all the splits and everything. So you could repeat that. You could do the next step, you know, 805 and repeat it and keep saving the channels and that's a super simple way to set up the space station repeater but I quite like using it in the VFO 73 uh, 2E0 UKH